ladies and gentlemen. Haircut. So out of shape. I recently found this website called Type Racer. You race other people at how fast you can type. I don't want to flex or brag too hard, but I am in the 99 percentile. I'm consistently busting out over 100 words per minute. Okay. You might think when I say the word keyboard, you're probably thinking, Oh yeah, yeah, no, I use a keyboard to make music too. This is my Casio keyboard. I bought it at Target six years ago. It does not work. No, I'm not gonna be using this. Instead, I'm gonna be using my super sick RGB gamer keyboard. You see how it lights up? That's how you know you can make some sick beats and also be a pro gamer at the same time. So here's Type Racer, okay? Now, as you can see over here, under the skill level, I am a mega racer. It's essentially the highest skill on the website. Average speed of 111. You know, it used to be, it used to be closer to 130. I had a couple of bunk races. Let me just do a demo race here before we get started. Oh, I'm joking. Oh, I'm joking. I'm joking. That's don't, that's, I can, I gotta sit down. That's not an accurate representation of my skill. You try, you try typing standing up. This is, oh, my average speed is dropping. I should never have done this. Oh! I'm gonna just try and record the sound of me typing, okay? I'm literally just gonna set my phone recorder next to the keyboard and I'm gonna race again and I'm gonna try and make some sick beats. Plunk. Yes, I'm raging over a typing game. Whatever. I literally dropped my average speed. I was just trying to sh showcase my skills and I have ruined my KD. Nice. Oh. Okay. Pretty pog, you guys. Why are they putting these full pages of novels in here? And that's me molding over a literal online typing game. Yeah, that's speed. That's speed. I think I get mad. Do I get mad? Fuck! <laughs> that's good. It's rhythmatic. This one's kind of like, it's got some, some chunk. It's like if the keycap is throwing up. Or burping. You know what? They all sound the same. Fuck! That's all, folks. Fuck! Plinky Plonk! Plinky Plonk. My arch nemesis on Type Racer. Their name is Pink. <laughs> Their name is Plinky Plonk. Fuck! Those are some solid uh, key slaps. There, that's it. Nice, nice and quick. It's a nice and quick um, keyboard fumble. That's cool. It is a little, little. It's like if there was a marching band and the drummers, instead of snare drums, like a marching drum line, instead of snare drums, they used RGB keyboards. Sweet. Nice. Cool. The goal of making music is to make it not suck. <laughs> it's like a, it's like a, a vinyl scratch, except with a gamer keyboard. I could do plinky. Novels in here. Or I can just not use any of these vocals. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Never mind. That's what I'm saying. I think that's like a really fun and interesting vocal sample and it will keep the listener engaged because perhaps they're thinking of something in their head and then before you know it, the song's talking to them and it's like, hey, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Keyboard warrior. <laughs> that's dope. That's what I'm saying. Just a chill like a... Uh, clap impact my sample pack i don't understand how but it's still at the top of the charts you guys are nuts five weeks in a row thank you if you weren't aware i do have a sample pack i just grabbed a sample from it this is 
a subliminal self ad. Thank you. Self ad. Yeah. I put a lot of post processing into how I develop sounds as they go. And usually after a few hours of constantly grinding and tweaking, uh, I'm able to get something like this. And this truly is the results of several hours on one specific sound. Music really is a conversation. And sometimes that conversation will last all day. We need, I kind of got to establish a key. Pun. Pun. I have to establish a key for the song. E, F, F. I like writing an F. Okay, cool. So we got a key. How about some amb ambiance? We don't say ambience in here. We say ambiance. Oh my God, Beyonce. Dude, ambiance. Yo, what if... What? Okay, what? Imagine you go up to Beyonce and you don't know that it's Beyonce and she's like, hey. And you're like, hey, what's your name? And she's like, I'm Beyonce. <laughs> I mean, I guess that technically counts as ambience. So what you do with ambience is you just make it so it's not even there. But it helps not make the song dead. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> and then I just reassure myself and agree with statements that I'm making. It's nice to have a song that agrees with you. Is this Pog? Fits the vibe better? It's like I'm piloting a spaceship that is my face. I am the baby. I'm proud of you. You know what? That's what I'm saying. Really cool pattern that you made out of the keys. That's what I'm saying. The intro is fire. As the person that made this intro, I could not have made a better one myself. That's what I'm saying. The buildup is extra sick. That's what I'm saying. See, that kind of tightens up our, our keyboard slaps. I'm going to stop saying semitone. I'm going to start saying semi-Thomas. Hey, the snare is a little dry. Can you add some reverb? Sure thing. Okay, try it now. And we'll be right back. This is take a crazy mess of a handful of keys. This is process GMO typing. But if I just get some raw, I haven't even added a stupid sub bass yet. Maybe we'll just disperse it and our problems will, will go away. No, not this. Why did I put this on? Well, actually. I'm writing a book over here. It's a novel. Hacker man's anthem. I hack for a living. I am a hacker. Oh, that's way cooler without the fucking obnoxious reverb. Fuck! Okay, I need like a, I'm gonna just gonna try and do like a knife party intro, but it's about a keyboard. Something like this. The giant horse cock weighs over 11 pounds. But about a keyboard. The colossal gamer keyboard weighs over six pounds. When used by experienced gamers with additional force of extraordinarily bright RGB, this keyboard is can be deadly when presented in any situation. Yeah. The colossal gamer keyboard weighs over six pounds. A predator in the online gamer cyberspace, the Magnus RGB projection can blind other users in 2.4 seconds. That's what I'm saying. When used by experienced gamers with additional force of extraordinarily bright RGB, this keyboard can be deadly when presented in any situation. Get the fuck out of my room and play Minecraft! Game a keyboard.
Well, you know what they say. Uh, I was hoping one of you did. I don't. I don't know. Oh, 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 oh,